rocket launches aren't smooth rides to space. They're barely controlled explosions where everything goes wrong. And success means nothing exploded that wasn't supposed to explode. Here's what TV doesn't show. Rockets don't fly to space. They fall toward space while burning fuel fast enough to miss the ground. It's not graceful aviation. It's aggressive falling with expensive fuel. The engines don't ignite, they detonate. Rocket engines are controlled bombs going off hundreds of times per second. The fuel mixture is so volatile that rocket fuel is basically weaponized chemistry with a guidance system attached. During launch, astronauts experience forces that would kill them if applied differently. 3 Gs of acceleration sounds manageable. Until you realize that's triple your body weight pressing you into your seat while sitting on top of thousands of tons of explosives. Most rocket mass is fuel, up to 90%. You're essentially strapping a tiny payload to a giant gas tank. Then lighting the gas tank on fire and hoping physics works in your favor. It's like delivering pizza with a fuel truck. Rockets have backup systems for their backup systems. If the primary engine fails, secondary engines kick in. If those fail, the crew capsule has escape rockets to blast away from the exploding rocket. We've normalized launching humans by strapping them to escape pods attached to bombs. The launch window, the precise time rockets must launch, exists because Earth is spinning, the moon is pulling, and planets are moving. Miss your window by minutes, and you might end up in the wrong orbit or burn up in atmosphere. It's celestial scheduling where being late means death. Weather can scrub launches for reasons that sound absurd. Too much wind, scrubbed. Clouds too thick, scrubbed. Rain? The rocket might get hit by lightning it creates by flying through clouds. We've built machines that can reach Mars but can't handle a Tuesday afternoon thunderstorm. The 3 2 1 liftoff countdown isn't ceremonial. It's the final checklist before detonating controlled explosives beneath humans. Each number represents thousands of systems confirming they re ready to participate in humanity's most expensive form of projectile motion. Success in rocketry means everything went exactly as planned during barely controlled chaos. Failure means expensive fireworks and explaining to investors why their satellite is now decorative debris.